Oh, well, it's nighttime, I guess, so. Hmm. Mm. Ah. Yes, I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side of your Everlight being, well, light. Or something, some other technicality. That being said, it allows people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I suggest you go to sleep, too, in that cozy little room atop of your cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go. The ship will start moving again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me. Waking up has never been my forte. You ring that big bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Have a good night. So I think in the time that it took me to uh, do the cooking that I did, it went to nighttime and I didn't notice because, well, I stopped immediately after that. Uh, let's finish that cooking. Oh, again, I fall off the boat. Oh my god, I love, I love the cat just unable to fucking deal with the water. Wait, what? Oh. Oh. You get... You get, uh, muscles and stuff from being on your... That are on your ship. That's cool. Can I do anything? Nope, still can't. Okay. Well, let's wait for the cooking to be done and then we'll, uh... We'll go take a nap, I guess. I'm just gonna watch these gorgeous animations. It's so fucking cute. Is there just an animate button? I mean, there is a hug the cat button. Oh, slightly undercooked fish. Oh no, did I take them out too early and they... They weren't cooked. Oh. I took it out like half a second too early because I clicked the wrong button. Okay, well, let's go take a very short nap, I guess. As the sun fucking rises. Oh, that's very cute. Oh, that's... that's too cute, actually. Hey, did you know everything about this game is amazing? The music, the animation... Everything. Well, there's... Oh! Let's go there. Good morning. Here's some food. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, that's all. Bye. I'm gonna... Cool, we're almost there. Okay. So, yeah, they just straight up give you a turn-on-head-off button, so... Oh! 
Ooh. It was like, well, you see what? Don't ask me how, but I've already met, I've met Albert already. He's definitely is a shark. His interest is in all things marine will be helpful. Such as boat upgrades he sells at the outrageously high prices. With those, he'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classical mythical challenges yet again. The cliche, if you ask me. Okay, yeah, no, the boat needs to stop because... Oh, I am holding down and you just jumped. I got something. I got a lot of something. Okay. We seem to have at least gotten a little bit of... Yes, I will come up and talk to you in a second, okay? I need to do some swimming to see if there's anything else out here before I head back in. You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me, but I am not surprised one bit. It adds up. You here, taking care of me in my final hours. Dots. You've always cared so damn much about others. Always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. From the day my father yelled at the cat. We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Dots. Father turned red and smashed the purple Delano vase. It was rad. Um. Well, I guess we're done here, so let's choose somewhere else. Looks like there's more stuff. Treasure wood or... Oh, that, that seems bad. But I can get lightning in a bottle there. And that's the cove that we have to go to to get the stuff we need for our uh, our whatchacallit. Dang, it's already nighttime, almost. It's getting close to evening. I want to do that double jump I got. That. Okay, wait. How does that hat stay on, Stella? Oh, dear. Look at that. Why is my mouse on the screen? Oh, wait. No! Not my task bar. Wait, mouse. I don't need you. Look at that. Hey. You should hop on the island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Oh, yeah, the boat. Duh. How'd you get so far ahead of me? 
Here we go. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. It's the best way to get the wood you actually need. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. Oh my god, I have to do this myself. That's so dorky. I love it. Like the cat is doing anything at all. That's the best. That cat's just floating in the fucking air. Taken for a fucking ride. Okay. Okay, okay. Alright, that's the end. We cut down trees, we got our ore, we got some berries. Well done. Congratulations. For you become death destroyer of worlds. Jokes aside, that's how you do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can take back. Uh, take. Then we can go back to the boat and begin the field with all those maple logs. I'll get to the night. Okay, yeah. So we got trees. We got ore. It's time to go back. I'm just gonna leave her behind. No, she's gonna be like right here. Yep. Okay. So time to build. Move that, and then place this. Huh, it's better looking than I thought. There's a little je ne sais quoi to it. Simple but elegant. Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in here. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. But you know me. I would kill a plastic cactus. Don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's one place where you could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. He has set up a shop in Humminbird, the busiest town in the area. Theodore and his brothers are founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Huh. It's two games. Yes, this world has serious problems of dubious business practices. Since I don't want to get sh swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingbird, then. Need to find some seeds for that field. I might have some seeds. Yeah, I have... Yeah, I, I have seeds to fill this. <coughs> um yeah, let's let's head but let's mm, let's explore a little bit before we head there. That's where it wants us to go. But what if we did like this island and then that other island on the way? What if we did that instead? And what if we cooked a little bit? We'd cook these mussels.
And it's suddenly evening. a little bit more treasure. We'll take all that we can. Honestly, I think we should head this way now. We got we got what we came for. God, this game is so fucking gorgeous. Oh, to have a houseboat with a little oven and a little stove and some little cabinets. Oh, looks like we're here. Perfect timing, too. Steamed shellfish. Oh, wow. That's actually a fair number of seeds and stuff. Uh, wow, that looks like the only thing here. Okay, well. Let's set a new course for the actual place we're supposed to go to. Can we build anything else? No, we need one more bright jelly for another kitchen. Uh, okay. I suppose let's sleep till morning. Gotta do our morning watering. Shit, this game has farming and fishing. Sam's gonna have to play it. I said that and he just, he looked over at me like, hmm. We're gonna have to get Game Pass turned on for you as well. It's a dollar. Act like it's the worst thing in the world. All right, we're here. Let's buy some seeds. Theodore set up a shop on this island. Let's pay him a visit. Oh, it's the island from the beginning. Or from the demo. Ah. Okay, you're looking for a house. Oh. Take a good look at this shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in the world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair and the Everlight. For this monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Two, the two slots in, in, on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use o Obos to activate it. 
But to get ovals, you need to welcome more spirits aboard your ship. I'm sure you'll find more lost souls like me. Okay, one more opal, okay. Yes. Oh, I thought you had something to say. No, I'm looking for a lost spirit. Hey, you fucking tanuki bastard. Step right up, potential prospects. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing Hummingburg since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard-earned glims. Step right up. There's Theodore. We go ahead, take a look what he's selling. Okay, key for Hummingburg. Oh, I can't afford that. Um... These prices are outrageous. What was that? Those prices are out of control. I won't let him get away with this. You ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Good, let's do this. Theodore, I know what you're doing here. And you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. What? Madam, what is the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. But, I... I can show you my business practices are quite above board. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, just fair prices. I... I... So stop being dishonest at once. And next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. You start being smarter. Mm. Got it? Mm. But, yes, yes, of course. I promise you I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. And there's our other spirit. Hey, you. Yes, you. And really gave that greedy merchant some hell. It would look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I could see it in your eyes. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You have to be able to jump inhumanly high to make it. I guess you could always use the stairs in that house. But some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever. Now, what are your actual prices, my dude? Okay, 5,000 is reasonable. Okay, that's reasonable. Um... Okay. You're still, if I recall correctly. Never forget a face, especially if they have shiny glims. Don't be shy, have a look at if you fancy. Got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. I was really hoping I could find another. I'm busy, miss. I simply adore your hat. Our local shop raccoon, Inc. Only carries garbage wares, seeds, logs, rocks, all useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Okay. I was really hoping I would find another soul so I can get... Oh. Hi. I made it here first. Let's be off, because there's nothing left here for me until I get somebody else. I've already done this. Way ahead of me, Stella. Your thumb is as green as your hat. It's not green. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget, you probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it, though. 
My garden acknowledges is simply is as limited as my father's empathy. You'll have to find better mentors than me, which reminds me, Dots. <coughs> I believe it's time for you to find new people. Not that I don't love the, the idea of just the two of us cruising the oceans, but you are the spirit fairer, and spirit fairers find spirits. Mm. And yes, help them fulfill their last wishes, however mundane they can be. I've heard a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you'll like, you'll like this one if he is who I think he is. Go. Let's sail. Please tell me it's the frog. Please tell me it's the fucking frog. I need the frog. We could go back to the shipyard. Does she mean like Oh, there. Okay. Well, no. Don't don't just try to go straight. No. No, 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 no. This. Th nope. That's still gonna be a little bit too much and we're gonna end up in the storm. Ah, let's see what happens. Oh. One second. I need to water these. I'll come talk to you in a second. What was that about? Mm -hmm. Hmm, I could go for an amuse bouche. Uh, I have steamed mm -hmm. shellfish. Is that shellfish? Oh, no. No, no, no. Not for me. Sorry. Well, fucking have popcorn. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. Okay, so it's raining, but it's not it's the storm. As long as we stay out of the, like, the central part of that, we should be fine, yeah? Let's see where we are on the... Yeah, okay, so we can make it through that. So then I can just plot a course for, like, here now. You know this game's really fucking good? Because it's really goddamn good. Oh, I almost jumped off the front of the ship, okay. I'm shocked we're staying out of the, uh, out of the rain. Actually, we should be able to just go straight to it. Yeah, we'll cut through the rain, but that's okay. Like, whatever. You know what? It's been long enough. We will, uh... We will see where this leads next time. Y'all have a nice night, everybody. I'll see ya.